Imagine a robot fish that eats microplastics and uses them as fuel to keep swimming. At the University of Surrey, engineers turned a student's contest design into a working prototype called Gilbert, a 3D printed robo fish built to tackle microplastic pollution. Gilbert swims like a real fish and filters tiny plastic particles from the water using fine meshes and intake channels. What's clever is the concept. Captured plastics are fed to an onboard microbial fuel cell or digestion module that helps produce electrical energy, allowing the robot to extend its mission without constant recharging. In trials and demonstrations the team showed Gilbert can collect microplastic fragments and operate autonomously for extended periods while carrying its meal. The idea echoes earlier eco-robot projects, robots powered by biological waste, but here the goal is clear. Turn pollution into a local power source so fleets of robofish could patrol lakes, rivers and harbors collecting trash while staying mobile. Important note, Gilbert is a promising prototype, not a turnkey ocean cleanup fleet. Scaling, reliability, maintenance, and the chemistry of converting mixed plastics into reliable power remain active engineering challenges. Still, as a proof of concept it points to imaginative, bio-inspired tools that could help reduce microplastic loads and gather valuable samples for scientists.